by Earth Signs. My name is Debbie and I'm an intuitive reader and I'm here today to give you your general weekly message for September 24th until the 30th, 2018. Please keep in mind that this is a general reading so if you are interested in a private one, all the information is down below in the description box. So we're going to first start off with Earth Signs here in the sign of Virgo. So for you guys, for the sign of Virgo, you have the page of pentacles so that page of pentacles is in regards to a message in regards to an offering of abundance of happiness okay i feel that you want to offer somebody this message because right after that is this other page of wands okay i feel because the back is to, is towards this person here this person is coming in unannounced basically to offer this abundance to offer that balance into a relationship to have this conversation somebody's coming out of the blue basically Basically to have a conversation with you okay in regards to a relationship that I feel is divinely guided with the Emperor here as well as the Empress okay that's a divinely couple okay divinely led couple that they're deep in their thoughts about for some type of movement in this car particular she always reminds me of the misses of the chariot she's in her cart for that movement they're definitely in their head about having this conversation, creeping up behind you, not not really, but you know what I mean, coming out of the blue in regards to that communication that they're, they're thinking about having this communication to have that movement in this uh, relationship. I feel that it's taking quite some time with the stagnation card of that hangman, Major Arcana, in regards to this relationship, all right, with the Two of Cups right above that hangman card. That's coming to a close, okay, in regards to that stagnation all right somebody now is going to put in the effort show the effort they just said in regards to working on that new beginning of that balance back into this relationship okay and it's going to be absolutely beautiful now the sun card is the best card that you can get it is a major arcana it is also known and it's old school but i use it it's also known as the yes card so i feel that somebody now after quite a stagnant situation in regards to a relationship that is meant to be divinely guided is now going to put that effort into this relationship. So you put these two cards together, yes, somebody will be putting in the effort now and will be communicating. I feel they're coming out of the blue and you're not going to see this coming. Now it can go either way, so because it is a general reading, but your outcome card for this Virgo is the Six of Cups. Possibly somebody from your past as well. It's just somebody whom you've grown to learn and love throughout the years, okay? That it's been patient. They've been going back and forth with their emotions as to what to do. They're patiently waiting to show that effort. Give that uh, even give and take in this relationship. Bottom line is this. I feel that after quite some time, deep in their thoughts about having that movement, that movement is to come back and to speak this truth, to offer that abundance. Also, the Page of Pentacles is known for that apology as well, okay? Coming to that closure of those burdens okay after deep in their thoughts actually manifesting i feel in regards to this relationship that has been very stagnant is definitely now going to be putting in that work putting in that effort and it's going to be beautiful it's going to be more of an even give and take after quite some time okay that is what i have for virgo so i hope that that resonates let's see who we're going to do next we can do capricorn let me just write down the time for capricorn here Okay, so for Capricorn, what we have, we have the Six of Pentacles and we have the Page of Pentacles uh, for your outcome card here, okay? The, your spread is the Two of Cups, the Ace of Swords, the Nine of Swords, the Knight of Pentacles, the Sun card. Sun card's been coming out for a lot of people this week. Uh, the Page of Swords, the Ace of Pentacles, the Empress, the Chariot, and the Five of Cups. So... In regards to Capricorn here, this is definitely in regards to a loving relationship with the Two of Cups here, okay? I feel that there's definitely a new beginning in regards to truth and clarity with that Ace of Swords, all right? I feel that this person needs to hear this truth because they've been mentally anguished in order to get that communication after quite some time. Meaning, with the Knight of Pentacles here, it's coming on in. It's taking quite some time to help clear things up in regards to that mental anguish, slow time coming 
coming, but this communication is definitely coming in. That Two of Cups energy is surrounded with the Ace of Swords as well as the Page of Swords right underneath it. So with these two swords here, the decision has been made to communicate, to bring that communication, that justice served in regards to bringing balance back into this relationship. The wild thing is, is that right above that... Uh, that ace of pentacles is that ace of swords so there's that two ones that's 11 that this is divinely guided okay absolutely somebody is more than ready to have this movement that has been trapped in their head i feel to have this movement absolutely with the chariot right after that all right with the empress and the chariot after such a long time there is going to be that change with that five of cups Five, it represents that change in regards to love, okay, with that cup energy, okay? Long time coming, I feel, but it's going to be absolutely beautiful with the sun card here. Now, like I say, it's old school, but the sun card is known for the yes card. So if you put these two together, this tells me with that five, there's going to be that change in regards to the cup energy of that love. And yes, that's going to change. Things are going to change. Bottom line, I feel that it could come out of nowhere with the Six of Pentacles here, okay? To bring that balance back in. You see her hands, her hands are kind of like, where'd you come from? You know, kind of feeling, all right? Clarified by that page of Pentacles, another page of Pentacles. They've been popping out like crazy. A lot of apologizing lately for people, I feel. There's that apology, there's that balance, there's that offering of that happiness. I feel that it's gonna come out of nowhere as well, okay? Uh, which is the same energy that I was getting with um, Virgo as well. So you could be dealing with a Virgo as well, but I feel it's coming out of nowhere, this balance, this offering, this communication, okay? After quite some time, there's going to be that movement, clearing of that sword, that Ace of Sword energy, cutting through that Nine of Swords with that mental anguish after quite some time. Somebody's coming back in regards to relationship and is going to bring balance and truth, okay? and movement into this relationship. So that is what I have for Capricorn. I hope that this helps and resonates as well. So in regards to Taurus, let's see what Taurus has to say. Okay, so for Taurus, what we have is the Nine of Cups, the Six of Pentacles, Okay, and then we have for your for your spread, you have the Ace of Cups, the Page of Cups, the Seven of Pentacles, the Three of Rods, which is Wands, okay, the Five of Wands, the Two of Swords, the Fool card, very nice, Queen of Swords, Ace of Rods, Wands, and the Moon card here. All right, so in regards to Taurus, uh, we have the Ace of Cups, so somebody wants to make a decision in regards to a new beginning in regards to love, okay? You have the, the, the Two of Swords right underneath it. The Swords representing thoughts, so you have to think about this decision to be made, okay? In regards to wanting that new beginning in regards to love. I do feel though somebody is definitely making that decision because he's literally facing the Fool card here. So there's that new beginning, taking that leap of faith and deciding that they're going to be opening up their heart, offering that page of cups energy here. A lot of motions. I made they make me focus in on certain things here. They made me focus in on the ace of cups here, all that water that's pouring out. A lot of emotions for somebody out there to offer that cup of love. Somebody that I feel that has been planted these seeds for quite some time, waiting for them to move on kind of thing okay i feel that they need to communicate this as well because you have the queen of swords energy now this is a people card gotta throw it out there people like to hear the signs so you could be dealing with an air sign quality gemini libra aquarius but I feel that there's some type of communication that needs to take place in order to have this new beginning of that balance. That Ace of, of Wands energy is that fiery, passionate new beginning, but it's also known for she's trying to balance her life here. So I feel that there's, somebody's been waiting for this communication quite some time, absolutely, with this Three of Wands. That Three of Wands is known for waiting, okay? Waiting for that sun to come out, waiting for that brighter future, okay? and waiting for that new beginning, waiting for that balance to come back into their life, to have that peace with that moon card here, coming out of the dark and having that peace now after a very struggling time 
with the five of wands that's been through this battle in order to have this change okay so i do feel that there's going to be this change of this battle and make it peaceful now with that moon card here very beautiful card that they've been waiting for to have balance back into this new beginning of their life that they planted for to be able to hear to have this conversation again i feel to offer that cup of love and have that new beginning into somebody's relationship here that somebody has seriously decided upon to have that new start of this new beginning of love okay and the outcome cards nine of cups very nice very happy this lady right Right here she always makes me smile she looks thrilled she looks happy okay in regards to wish fulfillment with that nine of cups energy and now there's going to be that balance just like this okay that balance with that ace of wands energy here that they've been waiting for an even give and take for that balance and get their wish fulfillment in regards to a relationship so that is what i have for all the earth signs out there i hope that this helps uh, thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel as well as click that little bell on the side to get updated information. I do weeklies as well as dailies. You guys have a great week and I'll talk to you soon.